This bouquet of flowers by Pablo Picasso is formally known as the bouquet of peace. It has other names such as hand with flowers and hands with bouquet among others. Picasso was known for his style of flowers and he chose to kept it simple. For this project, you'll need crayons, markers, watercolors, and a small piece of white paper. To begin, lay your hand on the paper and trace around it with a black crayon or a black marker. Don't worry about getting all the edges as you can go back and fill them in if you need to. When you move your hand, make sure you connect that hand to the edge of the page. Next, using a green crayon, you'll want to create some st stems for your flowers. You don't have to have a specific kind, but I would add at least four, maybe five, so that you can have some different flowers in your bouquet. Next, create circles of the flowers using any color crayon that you wish. They, I would fill them in all the way, but it's really up to you what color you want to use. Next, take another crayon of any color of your choice and start creating the designs for your flowers. Any colors will work, any designs will work. It's really your choice. Picasso loved to experiment, and I encourage you to experiment with different styles, colors, even materials. If you don't have crayons, prefer markers, go for it, experiment. Next, I'm grabbing my watercolors. And again, if you don't have watercolors, you can fill them in using markers or crayons or any material that you wish to use. I'm gonna dip my brush in water first and swirl it around my paint and begin to fill it in. You don't need to fill it in with the color of the crayon, you can use any color. I would suggest making each flower one color, however, so that the viewer can draw attention to your flowers and not look in other areas. When using watercolors, you wanna make sure that you're carefully swirling your color around and trying to keep each watercolor clean. Make sure you clean your brush after each color usage. Don't worry about staying in the lines. That's not really Picasso style. Next, I'm gonna put some green paint over each of the stems so that they can be seen better from the background. I'm making sure to go in between my fingers so that you can see that I'm holding the flowers. Next, I'm gonna pick a skin color crayon and begin coloring in my hand. If you wanna have a purple hand, go for it. Have a purple hand. Be wild, be crazy. This is your time to make things your own way. Lastly, since I don't like to use color, I'm gonna fill in my background using some markers and some lines. Again, experiment. If you wanna add a landscape, add a landscape. If you wanna do designs, do designs. I'm just doing a simple wavy line. And lastly, sign your art so that we know it's made by you.